Welcome to Zoho Sales IQ. This is a short video that will tell you how the codeless chatbot building platform in Zoho Sales IQ works. To start building a chatbot on the codeless bot platform, navigate to settings, click on Zobot and click on add. Give your bot a name, choose the platform which is the codeless bot builder and click next. Provide a description for your bot. Choose a brand, choose bot working hours and click on next. Then you can configure the rest of the bot configurations. You can choose the bot audience, when the bot should initiate a chat, the response interval, configure chat inactivity actions and also allow handoff to operators. Finally, click on create. Once you click on create, the codeless chatbot builder opens. There are four categories of blocks that you can choose from. First come response blocks that can be used to collect information from the visitor to complete a flow. Then you have action blocks that perform actions based on visitor needs and information that has been collected so far in the flow. You have data blocks that collects type based information like your name, email, phone, etc. from the visitor and stores them as per your flow. And you also have integration blocks that can be used to perform integration related operations like mail subscriptions, ticket creations, lead creations, etc. To add a card, all you have to do is click on the plus icon which is a card holder and choose the card that you want to. The Codeless Bot Builder has an easy drag and drop interface that only requires you to drag elements from the right side of your screen and drop them inside the builder. For each card, you can configure the message that you want to and then you can add the different options based on your requirements. The default text will be displayed here and you can make changes based on your own needs. Once you're done configuring, click on save. And the card will be added here. You can add as many cards as you want to inside your bot flow. You can also preview the work that you're doing every step of your way by clicking on the eye icon. You can also zoom in or zoom out in case you want clarity with respect to viewing the chart. You can also auto arrange your elements if needed. Once the flow is complete, make sure you don't have any open links and finally click on publish. This way, your bot will be published on the website and ready to pick up visitor chats and assist them with their queries. We hope you found this video informative. Thank you.